Michigan Attorney General on camera doing something you almost never see a prosecutor doing, talking about the people she's prosecuting. The Democrat, Dana Nessel, made these comments at a virtual event with liberal activists. The problem is, these are people who have been brainwashed. Well, these are the 16 people that she called brainwashed. They were the fake electors. Donald Trump wanted to lie and say he won the Michigan. In, uh, he say he wanted to win Michigan, wanted to say that he won Michigan in 2020. Now, Nestle's office is trying to convict each of them on eight felony counts. And legal experts say she may have made that harder with comments like this. How do you flip someone who concedes that they did everything that they're accused of doing? And why is the attorney general speaking about a, a case, an active case at a political event? Well, she shouldn't be speaking about it at the political event. Uh, seems like this is a careless mistake, classic unforced error. Ultimately, I don't think substantively it will tank the case. Uh, it certainly does hand some ammunition to the defense team uh, to make some haywood. They can argue that she's showing some bias. She may be tainting the jury pool, potentially. Uh, and most importantly, of course, the use of that term brainwash plays right into the defense counsel's likely argument that there is no criminal intent. They were just following orders. They genuinely believed what they were doing was correct. So she has created some issues for herself. Okay, so there was also this part where Nestle was touting the jury pool for the upcoming case. Ingham County, where Lansing was located, um, is a very, very Democratic-leaning county. Um, but I worry that there will be people who just won't care that they clearly violated the law because they believe that the ends justify the means um, and that, you know, it's okay to do as long as um, the end game is getting um, this autocrat into office. Should she be commenting on stuff like that? No, she shouldn't. Uh, that is much more clearly potentially tainting the jury pool. She's talking about the potential jurors, which leanings they may have to the left or to the right, uh, and that's problematic. She really should not be doing that.